Hey, hi everyone. I'm Ayush, CEO of Genlu, and at Genlu, uh, we help uh, business users directly chat with the data. Um, and the core tech is basically LLMs that we have customized for specific business use cases, and that is the vertical that we are working with India AI as well. How to build LLMs that are built for India Foundation. So, like in our space, what we are uh, building are evaluator LLMs or LLM guards that protect the input and the output that the LLMs generate for the Indian population from the Indian uh, sensitivities. So, imagine like no one should be able to give harmful inputs to the LLM. and no one should be able to get harmful outputs from the llm so this is a mission that protects 140 150 billion people of india from bad inputs and outputs and believe me you know like when you have an intelligence as uh, uh, you know as huge as uh, the llms today you have to kind of make sure uh, harmful inputs and outputs are protected so this is something that we are trying to do and it will protect every conversation an indian has with their llms so so first of all there's no doubt about it that gen ai and large language models like this is a new revolution in the digital space and it will change how we do business how we go about our activities so definitely uh, all the folks in the research community in the commercial community and we as individuals need to be excited about it uh the huge thing about the ai impact summit is going to be that this is a truly global summit like uh, as uh, the honorable minister and the secretary talked about we had one edition in london that was a safety summit then in paris which was the um action summit and then now we will have the impact summit so we'll have a conglomerate of uh, you know international ideas coming together discussing the future of ai and every enthusiast should be uh, there to understand better now like with nuclear bomb analogy uh, it has both the good and the bad sides right like there is things that helps power uh, power uh, a lot of homes then for medicines etc and then of course there is the bomb aspect of it as well and to prevent the cons of any great technology you have to make sure you have enough safety guardrails enough collaborations enough initiatives to protect uh, uh, people from that so similarly for ai first of all we have to make sure that the uh, work that people generate out of llms is always constructive it's not about terrorism it's not about making bombs and all those things so how do we come together to ensure the safety in that space and also like when we are releasing models how do we make sure it's not getting used for some uh, you know uh, against the humanities and all that so of course a lot of things have to come together but i'm very sure uh, you know like we have uh, taken care about previous tech revolutions in making uh, the humanity progress we'll be able to do it for this technology as well